Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and today I'm back on Assetto Corsa Competizione where we are going to be continuing on with this championship mode season in the Blanc Pain GT World Challenge Europe Endurance Cup. Today's round is going to be the Paul Ricard 1000Ks, which more recently has just been a six hour race. Now, instead of doing the full six hours, we're going to be doing two hours instead. So a third of the actual race distance. Now, the previous two rounds, uh, the first round at Monza and the second round at Silverstone, we didn't get any points. I think the first round we had a 12th place finish but it was pissing down rain so uh yeah i'm not quite used to getting this uh, lamborghini huracan around the track in the rain and then at silverstone we're basically running in the podium positions in the entire race until it pissed down right at the end and screwed our entire race over so hopefully just no rain today um you can see the leaderboards we we haven't got any points yet we are also competing in the silver category just because of the car that i chose for this uh this season but anyway without any further ado we'll jump straight into this race let's get into this i'm gonna go do a practice and qualifying and then we'll jump straight into the start of this two hour run around Paul Ricard. I actually really like this track. I mean, I know in F1 it's kind of boring, but in this GT category, um, a GT3 with all these cars, it's it's absolutely insane. Uh, we've only got 32 cars on today's grid because unfortunately um, I can't actually have the entire 60 or how, no, it's not 60, sorry, 40 plus car grid due to a set of course competition. Basically, stuttering like hell as soon as i move it above 30 cars it just i don't know what if it's my system or if it's the game but yeah i just get massive stutters as soon as i have more than 30 cars on the grid so yeah okay so that's qualifying done managed to qualify 16th uh not too good i think our pace is nowhere near as good as what it was around silverstone however it is a long race, two hours, so we have plenty of time to try and get back through the field um i'm really hoping for a top 10 i think that's a reasonable and enough goal um but yeah we're gonna struggle because our pace is, is just not quite there now we're gonna have to make a couple pit stops in this race actually i think we're gonna have to make five in total you have to make a pit stop every 20 minutes because it's just what the uh, game has set it to now this race actually begins in the daytime and we'll finish uh, under the cover at night so i'm gonna have to get used to driving this track at night because i've never done it before so <laughs> we're gonna have to learn as we go along but anyway here we go the blanc pain gt World Challenge Europe Endurance Cup round number three. Paul Ricard, 1,000 kilometers. Gosh, we're going real slow here. Starting behind a pair of Lambos. Just waiting for that light to go green. Green's out. Haven't got a very good jump. Alrighty, first corner's a quick left and right. So, let's see if we can dive down the inside, get a couple spots. No gaps. Have to follow suit. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Oh, sh friggin' bobbly things going everywhere. <laughs> we got a very long race, so we don't want to go making any mistakes now. However, it is GT3 racing, so we got to <laughs> make some moves when we can. Been a pretty tidy start, up to 13th. Right, here we got an Audi. Make sure that first pit stop is all set up. Uh, down one of the longest straights I think I've ever experienced. And now this is where shit gets scary. Back on the track before those bollards. Oh, that's too deep. No, 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 get back on. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Man, first lap, heavy fuel loads, cold, cold tyres and aero washes. No grip whatsoever. Let's try and keep with this Audi. So I get used to their grip levels. Big move. Come on! Lambo power! Italy versus Germany right now. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Oh, big move. Stop. Clear on the left. Car on the left. 
Ah, go away. So throughout qualifying and practice, this sector here, the second sector, has definitely been our strongest sort of sector on the track. I really struggle with the final sector uh, times-wise, so I've seen this setup is better suited to this long straight. <laughs> Get that straight line speed. Yeah, 280, 281. Yeah, hauling ass. I have got penalties turned off because they actually give you off tracks on I found on um, certain parts of the track where you would not get an off track in real life, so I felt it was pretty unrealistic. Right, but we're up into 12th, so gained four spots since the start. That's a lot better than what I thought we were going to get. See if we can push on, get a couple more in this first stint. If I go that deep. Come on, Joseph, focus. I'm not driving too well right now. I keep trying to drive it like I would in qualifying and it's not working. Change that. Oh, we've got a run here, lads. Top 10 is just ahead, 2.2 seconds, see if we can reel it in. Alright, first pit stop. Get on the marks good. It all comes down to how well you can stop on the actual mark. Oh, that's a bit far forward. Yeah. Uh, it's going to cost us some time. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, and back out. Ah! Damn it. Yeah, I knew I stopped too far forward. That's hurt us big time. Nine. Anyway, only lost one spot. Could have been worse.
I'm struggling to keep this lot behind me. I don't know why, but that AI are so quicker, are so much quicker in this second stint. Ah. I keep getting shit on the tyres as well. Alright, so end of the second stint, got a row of cars behind us, and we are struggling to, to hold on to this 12th, spa uh, 12th place spot. Seven seconds away from the car in front, just been gradually losing between two and three tenths each lap. Yeah, I just got nothing, I don't know what I'm going to do. They're all pitting. I haven't been given the pull, uh, call to pit yet, so stay up. Oh, come on, that's got to be good. No, ah, too early again. I mean, too late. Alright, so we just about held on to our uh, <laughs> 12th place spot. Just gotta get that stopping on the marks right. I'm usually pretty good at it, but obviously not today.
I've just got nothing for this guy, I can barely hold on to him. I knew as soon as he passed me he'd be off into the distance. Using this draft though, we've actually managed to get a little bit of, of a gap um, on the car behind. Man, that was a terrible lap. Alright, so third round of pit cycles is beginning. We are running, well, 10th, but two cars have pitted in front of us. Uh, what have we got? 2.7 second gap to the car behind, slowly losing time to the car in front, but hoping we can gain some of that back on the next pit stop. not prepared for this day night transition it's been running absolutely fine on all the other tracks I've been at so far it was ran fine in the rain at Monza but should have turned my graphic settings down for this one I apologize for the shitty quality uh, shitty quality Last lap before we make our final, uh, sorry, final stop, third to last bit stop. Back out. Back out in 13th, pretty much the same gap as what it was when we went in, maybe lost a little bit of time actually. Really need to work on getting that stop on the jacks right. Stop on the mark, sorry. So I've stayed the same pace this entire race, however the AI is just getting progressively quicker. Oh man, why is it they're all getting quicker and my car is getting progressively worse? <laughs> I just can't do anything about it. Nine! about 10 positions. God, I hate AI sometimes. It's got to be choking me. God's sake, man. I knew this. I knew that was going to happen at some point. Alright. Well, we're screwed. that I got all out of shape through the left hander and then I don't know what happened coming out of the last corner but it must have been alongside me but for fuck's sake man every single race so far in this series we've just been screwed over somehow <laughs>
you need now is a good couple of laps, see if we can get some of those spots back in the pits. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Ah, oh, I fucking knew that was gonna happen. You've got to be freaking joking me. Ah. Oh, you know, I'm done, lads. I'm calling it. That's just, you know, we're gonna have how much damage we got now? Yeah, 47 seconds. You know. Oh, my days. Well, that's another race running screwed up. <laughs> I don't know what it is with this Blanc Payne Endurance Cup, but we just cannot seem to catch a break. You know, we were in the podium positions the entire race. Last time out at Silverstone, got screwed over by the weather. Today, I've been collected by two AI cars. Whether or not it's my fault, I, I don't know, but can't believe I'm getting the ump over a <laughs> bloody AI car or AI driver, but anyway, it is what it is. We'll call it there, move on to uh, the Spa 24 hour, that's next. Hopefully we can just have some sort of result or some sort of luck there, but anyway, yeah. Thanks guys for tuning in. I uh, hope you enjoyed what was some of that race, and uh, yeah, until next time, I'll catch you guys later.